That is so, so awesome. So all we have to do is come up here and hello. Oh, and it just pushes it right up. See, this is, this is, oh, oh now I'm so excited because this is what I've been wanting to show you guys forever. Hey guys, Scotty here, just having fun playing games, making videos. I am back with another episode of ARK. In the last episode, we started building a new forge over here on the mountain, and there it is right behind me. It's almost completely finished. Let's go check it out. Um, so yeah, as you can see, it's pretty much building off of the same design as the other one, but it expands it um, to have a door on the other side. And of course, this landing area is 5x5 five five instead of 3x3. Three three. I got a nice little ladder to come down on here. And here we go. You guys did see um, me place this, all this stuff in the last episode, but I did end up finishing the roof, and I got it exactly the way I wanted it. Um, as you can see right there, um, the the triangle pieces they weren't they weren't working. Um, trying to place them from the slanted roof, so what I had to do is come over here, right about there where the slanted roof um, touches the wall. I had to put in ceilings and then build that up from there. And then from that point, I was able to just demolish the ceilings and everything stayed right where I wanted it to. So, really good. I added the windows to kind of give it the same design as before. And, uh, uh oh, we forgot two windows. Um, let's see, yes, I know I had some more. Oh, and I just picked up a Rex egg just outside. I don't know where the Rexes are, but hey, if they want to leave their eggs, who am I to argue? Let's come over here. Can we get. There we go, there's one. Oh! Oh dear. Hmm. Well, that's great. I'm not sure how I'm going to get that down. <laughs> okay, let's try this again, except this time, let's stand on the smithy. And can I? Oh good, I don't even have to jump. Hmm. I guess I'll have to demolish that ceiling up there. Do I have one? I have one. Just one ceiling left. Alright, so let's come up here. And I believe, can I see, uh, okay, so yeah, yeah, it was, it was this ceiling right here. Now, I don't want to demolish the ceiling because I think, um, that's what these railings are sitting on, but if I were to demolish this one right here, oh, that's, that's cutting it close. Hmm, can I reach this? Oh. It's close. Stone window wall, yes. There we go. And there we go. Okay. All fixed. Oh, you guys saw that? <laughs> I fell and um, grabbed the ladder. Alright, so let's put all this stuff in there. Um, so yeah, I, uh, I went out and gathered a ton of metal. Almost all the metal in the vicinity. Um, all the way at the top of the mountain, on the sides here, and over there, and all around this area. There's still a lot of metal on the way other side of the mountain, but I didn't bother with that. Um, and I smelted it all up, and do I have any extra left? I think I got it all. I'm pretty sure it's all back at the green base now. Yep. And I, w I decided I'm just going to leave 100 metal here, just for whatever purposes I may need it. And do we have all the stuff? We have a little bit of stone left over. Yeah, I was crafting up more um, spark powder. And of course, we've got Miss Annie here. She's uh, this is new now her new home. And I gotta say, after using her again and then testing Annabelle back at the base a little bit, I don't I don't really think Ankleos with melee damage are really worth it. Cause I mean, yes, they they help get the metal faster because I'm not having to do as many hits on it but I don't think it actually influences the total amount of metal that I get I really don't um, I know with um, gathering meat that definitely does the more melee damage you have the more it helps although I'm starting to think it's not necessarily the melee damage itself so much as the type of dinosaur gathering the material because um, on our Rex, I have his melee damage up a good a bit now. Um, a good a bit? What's a good a bit? <laughs> a good bit now. And he doesn't seem to gather that much more meat. Obviously, I'm 
I'm getting the meat in fewer hits. I'm not having to attack the corpse for more than once or twice now, but I don't think it's getting that much more meat, so I'm, I'm curious to know exactly how that works. Not that I could ever really find out. But um, yeah, I'm going to head over there back to the green base real quick, and I'll see you there. So here we are back at base lag. Yep, all the lag. Give me all the lag. Load it all in. Oh, boy. Okay, so... More? Really? Okay, so I put all the metal we have in the fabricator. You ready for this? Boom! Look at all that. We got two... Uh, I'm too lazy to count all that. Let's see. 1,700 metal. That's really good because, as you can see, we can now craft the large elevator platform as soon as we get the polymer. And I also went ahead and gathered a ton more pearls, um, and I made 100 more electronics, so that's good. And the cementing paste, I ended up scrounging up all the extra chitin and keratin I had. Um, I sort of had sort of a um, halfway stockpile going again, but I cleaned that out again. And do I have more? Yeah, I crafted 85 more. So, now we got... Let's stack all this up for easy counting. 264. So, that'll be enough for now, but... Uh, guys, we need a frog, and I'm seriously thinking about going to get a frog this episode. Like, just doing one of my all-day-long searches and getting one. Because I think we only need about six kibble and they take the scorpion kibble so we already have four and we have six more eggs so we could definitely get enough kibble for that um, I think that's what we're gonna do but first first we are going to finish the elevator that is order order of business number one um, so let's see we got we got enough for that need a little wood that just takes metal and then polymer so we're going to need 235 polymer, plus extra, because it'll probably spoil on the way back. And let's see. Yep. Yep. So I'm going to go get the polymer. And I think... Yeah, I'm going to bring Toronto with me this time. So yeah, I'm going to go get polymer, and I will be right back. And then we'll go ahead and make the elevator stuff. I am so dumb. I forgot my fur gear. Again. Oh, that's also something I was doing. I ended up gathering a whole bunch more pelts because not only was my head broken, but all this was pretty damaged as well. So we got a nice supply there. That'll last us a while. Now we're on our way. Alrighty, here we are. Tirana, I need you much closer. Uh, Periwinkle. There we go. Get you off follow. Take all the polymer. Yep, 391. Awesome. Stick all that in there. Almost going to fill up the whole slots. Wow. And then turn it on. Oh, oh, wait, 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 wait. Wait a second. There we go. I want to make everything. So wood elevators make the platform that was the biggest thing right there Whew. and then we'll just wait a minute is there anything else I did, uh, hold on a second electronics wood electro okay I just want to make sure that none of that needed um, polymer or sorry cementing paste well and polymer too but We'll go ahead and make all four, just because we are definitely going to use them. Even though I don't think we need four to finish the one elevator. And let's see here. Power generator. Electrical outlet. Oh, I just had a thought. Where am I going to put the power generator? Hmm. Let's, uh, let's turn this off here and check something out. How much metal we got left? Yeah, we got plenty, plenty of polymer. Sweet. Let's grab all this and yeah, that. Okay. Tirana. Actually, you know, guys, I'm gonna wait just a little bit for it to be daylight so we can see everything better. There we go. It is daytime officially. Nice 
sunrise coming up. So let's see, right up over in here. Here we go. Okay. Now, wherever the the outlet's gonna have to be. Hmm. I guess the best place to put it would be to be in this hidden layer right there. You know, I was thinking that I could just have like one power generator maybe back down here. Because I got this little platform here that I have to have um, for support of that. So I was thinking that I could just have the power generator back here. Hmm. Yeah, sure, why not? I mean, I, I could definitely hide it inside the, the floors up there, but... I kind of like the idea of having like a power station back here. Maybe I could do like a few extra generators and have like some some lights and some fences and some stuff like that to make it all look uh, look all aesthetically pleasing. Um, so let's move you a little bit to the edge here. And oh, we have the stuff in our inventory already. Duh. Okay. Power generator. Hmm. Now here's the thing. Uh, there was a way for me to snap this, and I can't remember what it was. It had something to do with pillars. So, let's see. If I put the generator here, that means I'm going to have to go vertically up the wall to how far? And i got to find out if the cables, the vertical cables, are more than one wall height. I think they are. So it's probably going to be a little bit wacky. Um, hmm. So it's going to have to go from there, up this wall, to right there, and then over. So I, I think I only need maybe 20 vertical, and then... Uh, well, that actually, that depends on which way. Yeah, I'm probably going to have to do a cross-section, and then... Okay, so I have an idea about that. What I really need to find out is how to snap the stupid thing. So, give me a second here, guys. I'm going to try and figure this out. All right, you guys. I finally figured it out. It wasn't snapping to the pillar from what I was remembering. What I was remembering was it was on a platform with pillars, but <laughs> after doing a little research, it turns out it's actually snapping to the elevator track pillar which is very nice to know. Um, so I just did a little experimentation here and it, it works. It, like, it really works. Um, so all you have to do is place down a pillar and then place down an elevator track um, and then snap the generator to that and then put down a cross section um, or any, any electrical cable actually and then delete the elevator track pillar and the regular pillar and the generator stays and you can even delete the generator and the electrical cable stays so that's what happened um, I have one cross section right here um, you can see this is snapping to it right like that so um, what I'm gonna actually do because the generator can snap to the electrical um, cable as well I'm just gonna leave that um, I, I made some more of these obviously I made two of the cross, two of the vertical, and how much? Six of the straight and two of the incline. Now the incline, I don't know if I'm going to actually need because the vertical, let's see here. Yeah, see, the vertical is like, actually it looks like it's almost, ex mm, it's just short of being two walls high. So I may need a incline to sort of balance it out. I don't know. We'll have to see about that. But at the very least, um, we got a cross section here and I believe, let's see here, let's line this up. There we go. I think that's right. Let's check. Yeah. Yeah. So now we got the cross sections in there and we got our perfect snap points which are dead center between this and the two tiles. So. Let's see here. We got a generator. Now, if I were to do this aesthetically, I'd probably want it to be like... Can I do something like that and... 
I wonder if I could like put two, like one here and then one like that and have it overlapping. That'd kind of look cool. It'd be like a double generator. Um, but I doubt if the game would let me place it because it would look obstructed. So we're pretty much going to have to do this and... I uh, don't know. We're going to need another cross section. Let me go, let me go build another cross section because I want to build cross sections for the entire floor there just so I have as many snap points as possible. Let's come back over here. Turn that on. And I forgot to grab this. Uh, let's make... Mm, let's make nine more. There we go. Turn that off. Grab that. And I don't need these pillars anymore. Nope. Wrong chest. This chest. So... We'll just put that on one. Fly back over here. The only thing that's concerning me about putting a generator area back here is that I'm going to have to keep flying back here to refill the gas. Thankfully, if I fill it up, I'll have enough gas to last me, well, I don't even know how long, but a very long time. Um, especially since this is a single player and it only runs if I'm online. So we got one here, one here, you need one there, and then another one there. I think that's right, yeah. So we've got all that. Um, Toronto, you need to move just a little bit back for me. Okay, so generator. Let's check this out. Um, now, from what it looks like, the snap point is actually this tiny little separate box sort of thing with the, see there's the big one and then there's a the small one. This looks like that's the snap point, so that's one and that's one. So I could do like two generators, one right there and one like that. And they'd be like facing the opposite direction but lined up with each other. And I could do like a middle one here facing this way. Or I could just do three all facing like this. That'd look pretty cool too. Oh, I could even do, like, into the wall. I kind of like this, actually. Because it's like it's it's built into the wall. Yeah, you know what? I think I'm going to do all three. Or I could do four. Oh, wow. I could do four right here into the wall. Hmm. Yeah, guys, I think I think I'm gonna do this. This actually looks pretty cool. I really like it. In fact, you know what? Since we have the materials and the time, I think. You never know about that time aspect. But let's come over here. I wanna build three more generators, since I have the metal. What do I need? Electron oh I'm out of electronics, dang. Um well, thankfully, I can create 55 more. That's going to eat up a lot of metal, though. Shoot, i got to be careful. So, how much does it need? 10? Okay, we'll, we'll build up to 30 electronics, then we'll stop it. Wait, where's my... Why doesn't the fabricator have a crafting queue? I don't understand this. I'm gonna have to just turn it off. Okay, just turn it off. Turn it back on. I'll make one more. There we go. Structures, electrical. Three more! Yeah, I'm definitely gonna go get more metal, more pearls. Lovely. Oh yes, I'm dehydrated. All right, there we go. Remember, this is purely for aesthetics. <laughs> Otherwise, I would not be going through this. But I mean, look at this. It's like it's built into the building. I love that. Let's come over here. Like that. 
like that, and like that. Look at that. That's so cool. I love it. Alrighty, so we're going to have to do a little... Can I get in here? Oh, thank God. I left it open for a good, good reason. So let's see. Come in here. How's this looking? Yeah. Yup. I like that. And then... Let's, let's see here. Is that... No. Each one's going to be right on it. So I guess... Hmm. Sorry, this is the uh, creative perfectionist in me. I, like, I want it symmetrical. So having just one, I guess just one on the end. It doesn't matter which one. But, hmm. Okay, do that. And then can I... Oh, I'm too close to it, I think. Yeah, there we go. Like that. We're definitely going to need to build more of these. Because we're already out. I only built two. Why did I only... What? I thought I built like four. Guess not. Okay. Let me go build some more. Alright, there we go. Oh, not craft item. Turn off, please. You know, guys, I'm thinking, and I'm not sure because I really need to get a timer or something to figure out how long the episode's gone so far, but I don't think we're going to have time to go tame a frog. Um, so I think I'm going to make that next episode because... These elevators, this is uh, getting to be a whole episode in itself. What am I doing back here? Well, you need to come in here. And I think... Let's see, is this the floor of the, the one we want? Yeah. So, let's see. I can't even fit in there. How am I going to get in there? Because I'm going to have to go in there to run... I'm gonna have to break a ceiling. Hmm. Well, let's, uh... Oh, I know, I know. Do I have any left? That's the question. Hmm. Nope. Can we build one? Absolutely. We can, because I've been gathering resources. These two are full of wood. These two are full of thatch. And this one's got some stone in it. I... Still got a little bit of stone collecting to do, so let's grab that. We are encumbered already. And stone buildings. Hatch frames! Let's build three of them. Because I always seem to need them. Oh, 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 wait, 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 wait. Ladders. I do have ladders. Okay, so I already made a hatch frame to get down to that floor right here, but I definitely need to do one for this one. So I think this is the only place. Hmm. Where's somewhere out of the way that doesn't look too bad? Could do it in the corner, but I was kind of hoping to put something here, some kind of station of some kind. I suppose I could do it right here. Hmm. Is, there's no place on the outside, is there? No. Oh, there is right here. But then I'd have to come fly here every time. Hmm. Yeah, I think I'm going to do it over here. Just because I will want access to it fairly easily. Let's come down here. This looks like the best place. Do that, like that, and ladder please. Oh, there we go. So, come over here. Where's the... Wait a second, where's the... D -d 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 did I not... Oh, I didn't build it down, shoot. I'm going to have to figure out... Okay, it's right... Okay, it's right here in line. So it's right... That's one, two, three, four, five spaces. So let's come over here. From right here. So one, two, three, four, five. 
I think this is it right here. What can we do to mark this? Do I have anything? Can I build a wall? I think I can build one wall. Um, actually, let's build a door frame just so we can walk through it. So... We'll put this there. Oh yeah, Durr, it's right here, the door. I can see the metal door. So yeah, so that's right where that is. So I'll need to put, I'll probably just have the, the, um, the what's it called? The electrical generator box. Yeah, electrical outlet um, stop right here, and then the cables will go straight up to there. I'm liking it. Um, so, question though, is this the outside outside? Or just... Gosh, I'm going to have to break stuff. I don't like doing that. Hmm. I think this is just the ceiling. And this is the... Like the where the wall is on the inside. So let's come over here. Yeah, I sorely underestimated how much work this was. <laughs> Let's see here. See, I don't know. I think so. Alright, let's do it this way. Like that, that. Nope. Like that. Is that going through yet? Probably not. Nope. Like that. That's still not going through. Can we turn around here? Whoa, like that. Okay, now let's go back over here and go inside again. And find where it's going through. Right here. Hmm. Not good. Because it no it doesn't snap anywhere inside of here. Yeah, this is kind of what I was afraid of. Let's see though. Can I snap this? Oh, yeah, like that. I could do that. Is that going to stick out though? Oh, oh what's this? Oh. If I go down, I think that's going to be right level with the floor. Hmm. Actually, let me let me go up a second. This should be completely hidden. Okay, so yeah. I think I'm going to do it like this and then of course then that's not that's not uh, in line. Ugh. I hate this. Why can't they have made everything symmetrical? Like that's now in line with the floor, but it's not in line with the creases. So, nope. Screw diagonal. Diagonal ruins everything. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Alrighty guys, well, I, I tried and tried and tried and I cannot figure out any way to make it so that I can snap electrical cables and still have it line up with building ceilings and walls. I just, it doesn't seem to have any sensible, like, system at all, which I really hate. I really wish Arc was far more symmetrical and actually you know, worked with each other as far as building uh, tiles and electrical stuff and water pipes and whatever else, um, elevators, like it's, it's all, it doesn't fit together at all and it's, it's really annoying. So, um, what I'm going to end up having to do is, I still got these vertical ones here and I deleted the, the one right there. So what I'm going to have to do is just use this back wall right here to come up to whatever level in the um, in the whole building I want to and then just have it at some some point between the two ceilings with the little um, the crawl space floors like this so this one's like that incline it's gonna have to be like this and it's not gonna line up once I go in there so let's come around here Yeah, see, it's over here. It's it's not 
it's not um it doesn't line up with the floor anymore see so th I don't see any way for me to to do that on these higher levels on the floor down there sure it'll line right up but on the floors here I don't see any way of course this is the main reason I had this little in-between floor here is to hide all this crappy nonsense about not lining up so that's that uh, let's see can I go no I can only go like that so yeah I'm gonna have to have one of those then I'm gonna have to come over here like that and then like that although this kind of lines up how does that work out oh because it, it lines okay so so this sort of lines up this way I mean that's okay I suppose um, can I then but see no cuz like no uh, no matter what I do is not gonna work so we're just gonna have to come over here have one like that and then we'll put the electrical box right here this is in the tile yeah okay right like that and then it it's connecting like that what's this what are you doing game that's not the way that works glitchy so glitchy but at least we have a connection now and we can come up and place our last few elevator tracks like that like that and then one last one like that and if we come down here yep so the elevator platform is gonna sit here right below this and it's gonna be perfect in fact do we have we have it can we place it no it's gonna want to place like that it'll still go down but to place it it needs it needs like that why are you obstructed oh the doors huh? okay move to run out of the way because I think she might have been in the way as well so hmm how am I gonna close these doors shoot well we'll do a couple at a time at least oh I know we'll use the elevator here we go guys you ready oh my game there we go I like that there we go it's on now we just gotta go get some gas I need to make more gas actually this power generator has been running forever and ever but um, we're down to a hundred so we'll grab like 40 yep. Now I'm curious, these power generators should all be linked, so it shouldn't matter which one I put it in. So we'll put it in this one, turn it on. Oh, that's going to look so cool with all four of them being turned on. Of course, that's going to be a huge waste of gas, but hey, <laughs> aesthetics, right? So is this powered? Oh, it's powered. Oh, wait, stop. come back. I suppose I could just use this. So there we go. Oh, it just disappeared. Oh, that's so cool. And then if we come down here, yep, see it's sitting right here. That's so awesome. That is so, so awesome. So all we have to do is come up here and hello. Oh, and it just pushes it right up. See, this is, this is, uh, oh, now I'm so excited because this is what I've been wanting to show you guys forever oh man okay so let's go back up and close the door this is gonna get annoying having to go back and forth stop stop like that and then close that last door and come all the way up Ta -da! and see it sits right there look how perfectly aligned that is and that's gonna make it so that um, Come here, Rex. Oh, that's not my spyglass. Come here. I want to show off the platform. OK, 
Come on. Now this way. Oh, he just barely made it. So yeah, if we come on him like this, there's still going to be a little bit of a glitch. There, see? But then he kind of walks right on. It's not so drastic. Um, usually it's like a whole, like, his head pretty much goes to where the platform is, that kind of a glitch, but it's just a little one like that. So, yep, there we go, and I believe we can just hit that. Oh, guys, our elevator is working! And then all the way down, and now we're on that. Oh, yes! Oh, it's working! Okay, had a little trouble there, turning around. Now here's what I want to test as well. If I come in here like this, can I then just face that? Oh, it works! It works! And I'm going up. Oh, this is so cool! Yay! Oh, guys, it's it works perfectly. Perfectly. Whew. Alrighty. So yeah, this is the little gap I was telling you about a few episodes ago. Whoa, are you moving again? Dehyd- uh. No! Rex, where'd you go? And crap, I'm dehydrated and I have no water. Where's Tirana? You over- Come here, Tirana. You're gonna get trapped, aren't you? Nope. I know, I'm dehydrated. Come on. Nope, you're not going to do this? Okay. Oh, nope, I didn't catch him. Okay, where'd Rex go? I think he fell. Oh, there he is. Okay, let's get some water before we die. And you can just stay right there for a second. So I want to come back up here. Okay, as I was saying, um, this little gap here, I can still walk across it, right like that, see? It's just a little bit of a, a drop down, but I'm not going to actually fall, even though it completely looks like I'm going to fall. Um, and I believe if I, yeah, if I kind of like crouch down here, I think I can force my way through. I, I was able to when I tested this, but actually it's not looking like it's doing that. What about prone? Nope. Okay, sweet. So I'm, there's no chance of falling. That's awesome. And this is not going to be like, eh, I can sort of run into it and it'll stop me. But it's just that one little space. It's no big deal. And I can still walk over here and like this. And it's so exciting. It's perfect. It is perfect almost. Like if only I could make the stone go like this. Or better yet, better yet game, just make your platform a little bit wider. Sheesh. But yep, there we go. One large elevator platform. And now imagine, imagine having one here, one there, and one wherever the other one is. Oh, man. Perfect elevators. Can't wait to have them all. All right, you guys. I think that's it. I hope you enjoyed the episode. If you did, hit that like button. And you can subscribe for more videos. And I just want to say... When you're watching this, it's probably already happened. Um, I'm starting a new phase of my schooling, which is going to make it so I can't make videos. I don't want to say hardly at all, but it's it's going to be quite reduced. So if you don't see anything for a few days here and there in between videos, that's why. I am very sorry. I really wish I could keep doing this for, for the past couple. Has it been a, about a month now, I think? Um, I've been able to release at least one video a day. Um, but... That's not going to be able to happen in the near future, so I just want to give you guys a heads up on that. I am very sorry. I'm still going to do as much as I can because I do love making these videos. But yeah, I mean, life happens. you got to do what you got to do. So really hope you enjoyed the episode, and I hope to see you in the next one. Have a good one, guys.